our cave facility is a three-dimensional cave. That means in earlier days we have produced all the drawings on, in, on two dimensions and now with the cave we have the opportunity to three, three dimensional rise. We basically create a car. It's a virtual prototype. So once we have this uh, model in the, in the cave, we can start to interact with it. We can often close doors, have a look from the outside to the inside. Opening the rear door as well and observe how the first impression of the vehicle is. In the cave, you have a tracking system, for example, on, on, on the glasses, and you have cameras in the corners and on top of of the cave ceiling where the system will recognize exactly in which position you are in the vehicle and therefore the system calculates automatically what kind of view will you will have. So you can turn around and then the whole vehicle turns. You can adjust the mirrors, you can see what, what you see through the mirrors, you can adjust the, the steering wheels. So you have the feeling that you are really sitting in a car. You have the big benefit that you can feel emotions, you have a feeling inside the car, you can feel the roominess effect of a vehicle when you sit inside. The future of the cave technology is from my point of view to have a virtual vehicle where you can do up to 100% of all your assessments that you don't need prototypes at all in the future.